Hello everyone, this is a November 10 question, paper 1 1 and question number is 8. It's concerned with the chapter enthalpy changes. Uh, and uh, this is going to be my final video from this paper, paper 1 1 of November 10. The question reads Enthalpy changes of combustion can be used to determine enthalpy changes of formation. The following equation represents the enthalpy change of formation of butane. So we have 4 carbon atoms plus 5 hydrogen gives uh, butane in gas state. Carbon is in solid, hydrogen is in gas because that's what they are at uh, 25 degrees Celsius. Uh, by using this, uh, by using the following standard enthalpy of combustion data, this is a data. What is the value of standard enthalpy change of formation delta HF for this reaction? So our first approach should be to construct a relevant enthalpy cycle. Uh, constructing, uh, determining enthalpy change of formation from combustion, uh, the cycle should be following. First, we'll just copy uh, the same equation here. 4 carbon plus 5 hydrogen uh, gives us butane. Uh, now, uh, combustion means addition of oxygen. So, when we add oxygen to both of these, so we'll get uh, carbon dioxide and water. Gas. So, uh, arrow goes here. Here. And uh, this is what we need to find the enthalpy change of formation delta HF naught. So we'll add oxygen, mm, oxygen, uh, oxygen. And although the uh, stoichiometric uh, value is uh, not relevant here, we'll just uh, add it for uh, safety purposes. Uh, balancing the equation, we'll have four here and uh, five here. Uh, this is 13, so 13 by 202. Uh, it's also the same, 13 by 202. Now, what uh, this arrow represents enthalpy change of combustion of butane. So, uh, we can write this as delta H C naught of uh, butane uh, with the value given here minus uh, 2877 kilojoules per mole. And uh, this arrow represents four times enthalpy change of combustion of carbon uh, enthalpy change of combustion of carbon plus uh, five times enthalpy change of combustion of hydrogen five times delta H C naught of hydrogen so this is uh, four times minus 394 uh, plus five times minus 286 uh, so this gives us uh, Calculating the value, we'll have 4 times minus 394 uh, plus 5 times minus 286. So this is minus 3006, minus 3006, and uh, this is minus 2877. So using triangle law of vector addition, uh, we'll have uh, we'll take this side, uh, this arrow as positive. So we'll have delta H not F plus uh, this value uh, going uh, downwards is going with the arrow so plus negative 2877 now here we are going against the arrow so it should be minus uh, minus 3006 so we are starting with uh, same place uh, we, end, we are ending in same place we started so uh, addition of these all three should be zero so delta H not F is uh, this becomes plus so plus becomes minus when it goes to the opposite side this is negative so it becomes positive 2877 plus uh, minus 3006 uh, which is minus 129 kilojoules per mole making B the correct answer.